the new Logic Pro 1.1 allows us to select and drag and drop multiple files. Here's how it works. We're in the very convenient split view. And what we're going to do is I'll show you first what we used to have to do. I've got eight different stems here. So stems are just sort of split up files of a previous project. And I want to bring all of these into this project. The way we used to have to do it was to tap and drag on an individual file, drop it into our project. Now, these are actually the different sample rate. I'm using 48 kilohertz in Logic Pro. These are 44.1 kilohertz, but you don't have to worry. You can either change your project or you can convert the file. I might actually change the project this time around, which means Logic Pro will now have changed it to, uh, th to a 44.1 kilohertz. It's actually also imported the tempo information which is pretty darn cool and there you go it has set that file there ready to rock and roll and play with but again that is just the one file what if we want to import all of these files at once well now we can thanks to the awesomeness that is multi-file drag and drop so let's undo that what i'm going to do now is tap in the top right corner and tap on the select button what i can now do is select individual files if i wanted to just pick and choose which ones i want or even more convenient because i want every file in this folder i'm going to tap on select all that's going to select all eight files all i need to do now is tap and hold and drag all of these eight files and drop them on one track and look at the magic that's happening here and that is that it grabbed these files and it has created eight individual stereo audio tracks ready for me to start playing around with these stems it's even put them in number order it's going to make it super convenient if you say using a different digital audio workstation you've got someone using logic someone using pro tools someone using fl studio and you want to collaborate it's going to be so much easier to be able to stem out or export as wave files or as individual files and then bring them over here into logic pro quick as you like